Please don't cry, Jackie. Don't cry. Listen, lady. Can you please keep your baby quiet? It's been crying for 20 minutes. It's giving me a headache. I'm sorry. I'm really trying. This is ridiculous. Okay, honey, honey, it's okay. Mommy's here. Calm down. You know what? No. <laughs> I can't do this anymore. I'm so sorry for the way that man spoke to you. You know, sometimes people just don't realize how hard it is to be a mom. Do you need any help? Oh, it, it, it's fine. I just, we've been waiting at this hospital for over an hour to see my mom, and she's just getting really fussy, and I'm just getting so stressed out right now. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to put all that on you. It's okay. You can talk to me. I had that same thing happen to me with my baby. Oh, shh, shh, it's okay. You know, I think I may have something that may help. What is that? Ah, here it is. There you go. <laughs> wow, thank you. I have never seen her stop crying this fast. How did you know this would work? Well, because a long time ago it worked for me. You see, I was just like you. I had my baby girl, and no matter what I did, she wouldn't stop crying. People were getting so angry, and I didn't know what to do. But then, out of nowhere, a kind stranger came and helped me. She gave me something that I would never forget. A teddy bear. And like a miracle, my baby stopped crying. She ended up giving me that teddy bear. And she told me that there would be a moment where I would have to do the same thing for someone else. So you see, this is that moment. Wow, what a beautiful story. That lady changed my life in a way that I will never forget. I wish I could tell her. Hi, Miss Watson. We're ready for you. Okay, I'm coming. Seriously, thank you for everything. Here's your bear. Oh, no, no, no. There may be a moment where you may have to do the same thing for someone else. Oh, thank you so much. I will put it to good use. <laughs> so how is she? Great. Her blood pressure is perfect. Her cholesterol is in good shape. There's nothing wrong with her. Really? I mean... That's great news, but she's been feeling so down lately. I thought there was something wrong with her for sure. Well, we do tend to see this with older patients. We call it a later life crisis. It's when they feel like they haven't done enough with their life. Oh my goodness. Is that how she's been feeling? I had no idea. Well, let's head in there so you can talk to her. Hi, Mom. Oh, hi, sweetie. Look who I brought to see you. Oh, my granddaughter. I've missed your beautiful little face. She missed you, too. 
So, the nurse said all your test results were great. Isn't that amazing news? Oh, uh, that's good, sweetie. Mom, you don't sound that excited. Oh, I am. I I'm sorry. I I've just had a lot on my mind lately. Mom, you know you can talk to me, right? You just haven't been yourself lately. Please tell me what's wrong. Oh, sweetie, it's just... I'm 65, and I can't help thinking, what difference has my life really made? You know? Mom, don't think that way. I mean, if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't be here. And neither would Jackie. Oh, I know. I'm sorry, sweetheart. You're right. Oh, look what I've done. I'm so sorry. Shh. Jackie, it's okay. Shh. I have something that might help. <gasps> wow, it worked! And so fast! That bear, it looks so familiar. Well, this nice lady just gave it to me. She said there was a kind woman that gave it to her years ago. And she never forgot it, that it changed her life. Mom? Is everything okay? <laughs> oh, everything's just fine, honey. I just realized my life really has made a difference. Now let me see my granddaughter again. <laughs> Here you go. Look, Jackie, look at the bear. <laughs> Hey Darman fam, thanks so much for watching that video and I hope you love that message. 